is testing at Cincinnati Children's Hospital could save thousands of lives one day. Liz Bonas has been following the story. She joins us now, Liz. Good evening, guys. Our heart team at Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center is the first in the world to conduct a clinical trial using a unique stem cell therapy. Now, it's been used in adults, but never in kids before. And in a story you will see only here on Local 12 News, it could change the course of lives forever. Caleb Sizemore is an 18-year-old college student majoring in hospital management. He's been cared for in hospitals much of his life. He has Duchenne muscular dystrophy. Which is a progressive um, degenerative muscle disease where you lose muscle functioning over time. One of those muscles, the heart. So the disease they develop is a thing called dilated cardiomyopathy. And I have some scar tissue in my heart which that's normal for the disease. The good news is that Caleb's team, led by Dr. John Jeffries, may be able to slow down the progression of this heart problem with a new treatment he's been given. It's called cardiosphere-derived stem cell therapy, or CDC therapy for short. It's the first time this has ever been done in this population, and it's one of the very first times it's ever been done in a children's hospital anywhere in the world. The cells are taken from donor heart tissue, expanded so cell, in a lab, and then infused in and into the heart. Since cells. stem cells take on the properties of other cells. This therapy actually offers us the opportunity to reverse some of that scar tissue. And if we could reverse the scar tissue, in theory, we could keep the heart muscle normal indefinitely. What makes this so exciting, however, has to do not just with this patient population, and we could learn a lot about them, but more importantly, it may help future generations to come in a whole new way. There are millions of people in the United States that live with heart failure and heart muscle disease that don't have Duchenne. The findings of this study could actually inform those other populations. So in theory, we may be helping millions of people across the globe that have heart muscle disease and heart failure. This is big stuff. They're following Caleb now. We won't know how well this works for about six months. What happens is they have to take MRIs of the heart, but they think they could actually see the scar tissue reverse wow. or maybe even just delay. And if they can do that, then it would be like giving someone repeat uh, high blood pressure medicine where you could continue to offer this therapy. It gives me chills. And it's happening down the street. Yes. Here. Yeah. Just okay. really a remarkable six stuff. Six months. Yes. Let us know. Absolutely. All right.